Hey, I'm Pastor Mark, and so glad you came back today. As you know, I'm here Tuesday through Friday, and hopefully each day you'll have a good day. The reading for this morning is from uh, the book of John, chapter 10. Very truly, I tell you, anyone who does not enter the sheepfold by the gate but climbs in by another way is a thief and abandoned. The one who enters by the gate is the shepherd of the sheep. The gatekeeper opens the gate for him, and the sheep hear his voice. He calls his own sheep by name and leads them out. When he has brought out all his own, he goes ahead of them, and the sheep follow him because they know his voice. They will not follow a stranger, but they will run from him because they do not know the voice of a stranger. One of the hard parts about today is it seems to be there's so many conflicting, much conflicting information on the, the pandemic, on what we should do and what we can't do. Whose voice do we listen to? There's different opinions in the press, on TV. We have so many voices coming at us. Whose voice do we follow? Well, how do we hear the voice of Christ? How do we hear that voice that uplifts and forgives and renews all of us? Not just some of us, but all of us. We do that by taking time for prayer, reading the scriptures, and then through prayer and reading, we're honing our heart. We're honing our hearing, if you will. Because that's how we distinguish Christ. Christ's voice is with our heart, most of all. So we go about our daily lives. We pray, we read, we ponder, we listen with our hearts. And we will know which voice to follow. The one that loves and forgives and renews. Each and every day. The one who knows your name and calls you out so that you can follow through what comes what may, the good, the difficult, the hopeful, the sad. We know that voice and that voice knows you and loves you. Have a good weekend, everybody. Hope to see you on Tuesday. Take good care.